She slept like a baby. <laughs> How'd you sleep? I slept like a big baby. <laughs> a big baby? Big baby. <laughs> Last night, um, I was in my room, and Roberta came to get me because she was worried about me being alone. And we just stayed up talking and hanging out till about 2 AM. <laughs> <laughs> The plan was for me to have alone time with Roberta, but Roberta felt very um, sensitive towards Danielle's feelings, and Danielle tried to resist and fight. It was funny to see them both debate with each other, but they haven't seen each other in a year, and they're so close, so we ended up sleeping in the same room together, me in the middle, and the two ladies on each side. So I brought her here with my little baby. Last night was very special, so I wanted to bring the sister close to us. I was not going to be able to leave her alone there in the room, because after a long time without seeing us, my love spoke louder, so I brought her here with my little, little, baby. My little baby. Oh, wow. <laughs> little, little baby? baby. <laughs> me? Me, little baby? Sister. Oh, sister. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. It truly means a lot to me that Garrick and Roberta would set aside their intimacy for that first night. It gives me reassurance that Bert is in this for Garrick and also me, and that we're all united together. I didn't have to be alone. Eu não precisava ficar sozinha. No, no. <laughs> united sisters. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> After Roberta demanded that she stay the night in the room with us. Danielle had to go back and get her stuff and stuff, so me and Roberta were able to be intimate uh, quickly before Danielle came back. And it was a good laugh, because Roberta was laughing, oh, no, sister, be back. <laughs> um, does Danielle know that? No. <laughs>